right? So I have their spread in front of me. This is just to save time. So we're gonna go ahead and check your spread. All right. Current situation for you, Taurus. We have the Seven of Cups with the Page of Pentacles in reverse. There is a lot of confusion around the situation. Okay, maybe you're confused, the person you're dealing with, you're both confused. Okay, someone either has a lot of choices or this is someone who's daydreaming. Okay, I'm getting a lot of wishful thinking out here. There's someone out here who's not being able to decide, you know, someone who's just uh, being very indecisive right now. They don't know. Uh, it can be two things. Either this person doesn't know uh, the best approach to make towards you. Or I'm getting this person does want to approach you, okay? But they don't. Uh, but they don't know if this is the right time. Anything, okay? But again, they're thinking. I'm getting a lot of thinking, okay, with the seven of cups here. And you could be dealing with someone who's very, very immature, all right? Someone who's irresponsible, immature, or this is just someone who's procrastinating, okay? Because of which there could be a lot of missed opportunities. This person probably wants to wait for the right time. They want the entire situation to be like a hundred percent before they come in towards you, or they want everything to be in their favor before they come in and talk to you, okay? So. This the seven of cups is a lot of visual thinking yeah i can do this yeah i can do that yeah i want to do this yeah i want to do that but they're just talking they're just not doing anything okay this is just a lot of talking but no action what's on your mind we have the ace of wands with the seven of pentacles in close so I feel that you're feeling a little inspired inspired by the ace of wands here i think you're wanting a new beginning okay you're wanting a new beginning with this person Definitely. You are very enthusiastic. But at the same time, okay, with the seven of pentacles in reverse, I feel that you feel something is a waste of time. There's a lack of growth here and you're just growing impatient. And impatient because of this current energy. There's someone who's just completely confused and uh, they're just not making a move towards you. Okay, this is all in their head. They're all in their head in their emotions, okay? But again, you feel that something was a bad investment, is a bad investment. And again, you have a lot of passion. You want this new beginning with, you want this clean slate with them, okay? But again, because you feel something was a disappointment in the past and it will probably not grow and you're procrastinating too for the Seven of Pentacles in reverse. I'd say you're procrastinating too with the Ace of Wands and the Seven of Pentacles in reverse. It's like, yeah, I want it, but I don't know if I really uh, want to put in the effort. Same shit, all right? The person you're dealing with, what are their feelings? They are the five of pentacles with the four of wands in reverse, okay? This person is feeling left out by you, okay? They're feeling very isolated. They're feeling very left out by you. There's, um, this is a loss. They're feeling isolated. They're in isolation. They're feeling abandoned, okay? And this is all happening because I think there is a lack of support from your side or probably, you know, this is just a lot of, either this person is going through a lot of conflict you know, like a lot of um, home conflict, either there's something that's going on within their environment, within their home that you don't know about, or this is just someone who feels that there's a lack of stability, there's a lack of growth, there's a lack of harmony within the relationship, and I think they shut out by you, or they're just feeling very, very codependent on you. What are your feelings for this person? We have the three of swords and the two of cups in reverse. Ouch. You're feeling, I mean, you know, the separation and heartbreak, whatever this is, right? This is weighing very, very heavily on you, okay? There's a lot of sadness, grief, sorrow, trauma, okay? Because of this separation. And I think with the three of swords, with the two of cups in reverse, you're, you're feeling this imbalance within the relationship, okay? There could be uh, no communication between you guys, okay? A lot of tension, okay? But someone's feeling that withdrawal, okay? Maybe this, there, this is someone who's feeling you completely pulling back your energies from them and they're feeling those withdrawal symptoms, okay? But yeah, this, this separation breakup has really affected you a lot. Again, feel free to flip the sides, okay? This could very well be the person you're dealing with and this could very well be you. But yeah, someone's very, very heartbroken. Very heartbroken. Okay? It's like they can feel something cut through very deep through them. And with the two of cups in reverse, so they're, like, like I said, right? The feeling you've completely detached from them. And you guys are not seeing eye to eye right now. The separation has caused a lot of pain in them. And they feel it yet. Again, with the ace of wands here, this is someone who really wants this, right? Or this is you who wants this, but again. This could even then be feeling that, you know what, like it's going to be the same cycle again or probably they feel that you think or, or you know, you think they feel this is a disappointment, disappointing situation and that's why you're just taking your time to grow, okay? 
with the current situation i feel it is you who's thinking like this you're thinking you're procrastinating constantly this person out here is feeling left out okay because again there could be a lack of commitment lack of structure within the relationship okay and again they're feeling very left out they could probably even feel that they're uh, they're not with you okay or you're not with them you never supported them etc but again this is a lot of loneliness what are their feelings towards you we have the star with the 10 of wands in reverse so yes this person definitely has a lot of hope in this situation okay they're remaining very very hopeful about this they have a lot of positivity they want a renewal in this okay they want a renewal they want to heal the situation they want a rejuvenation but again at the same time this person is feeling very very burdened with this relationship okay i think they're trying to heal from a relationship Maybe this relationship after a while it became very very burdensome, okay? And this person just had to lay it on. They could even feel that they're shouldering too much responsibility. This person again, ten of wands in reverse. This person could either have I'm getting a lot of home conflict from this person, okay? Four of wands in reverse, ten of wands in reverse. This person has a lot of burdens on their shoulders, okay? I don't think you're someone. You're you you are not really someone who's. affecting any of the uh, trauma that they're going through right now or any of the conflicts that they're going through four of wands in reverse is a home card 10 of wands in reverse is again a lot of responsibilities on this person's shoulder okay where this person is probably almost collapsing collapsing or at the um, at the end of a breakdown okay i think this person needs healing they want to heal they want to rejuvenation with you right but again they need to heal because they're feeling very pressured with whatever is going on okay there's an imbalance about something This person could be also someone you know who does not delegate responsibilities with their partner or does not delegate responsibilities within the family, and everyone's very very um, like the entire family is dependent on them. Okay, could be the mutual energy between you and this person that you're dealing with is the hangman and the moon here. See, yep, yeah, that's exactly what I said. The hangman and the moon. There is nothing happening between you guys. There could only be a lot of thinking. You guys are thinking too much, but there is a lack of action here. Again, someone's either sacrificing. Okay, the moon, the, the hangman can be someone sacrificing temporarily, or this is just someone you know waiting because there is a lot of uncertainty right now within your uh, direction. There is a lack of direction here, but uh, I think there is a lot of contemplation happening. and only because of the confusion here the moon is confusion fear stress anxiety but i think there's a lot of confusion here because again seven of cups confusion the moon here confusion and it's all happening because there's one person here or both of you all are just constantly you know procrastinating should we make this effort should i go and talk but there's someone who's just on moving towards commitment okay that because either they have too many options too many choices or they just don't know which is the right way to go but again the mutual energy is you both are doing nothing about this and with the moon here just confusion fear of what you can't see ahead a lot of fear based confusion this is all fear based the moon moon has nothing to do with your reality and that's why things are at a complete halt stand still okay nothing's moving no action every single time i use these cards and i keep saying these cards are so pretty they're so beautiful i just get so carried away by them i think just like watch them all day what's your attitude towards this person we have the page of cups and the devil here you're obsessed with this person okay i think you're obsessively in love with this person that's all i can say you're fantasizing about this person left right and center you're daydreaming about this person you're romanticizing you're fantasizing this person you know but again at the same time you're being very very illogical okay this is someone the page of cups is someone who's very very innocent also so yeah this is all like nice lovey dovey energy yes i get it right but with the devil here right i feel that um you're obsessed is what i'd say okay you're obsessed with this person you have this certain powerlessness when it comes to this person okay like you just cannot help but get drawn away to this person you're i mean obsessively in love with them is what i'd say that's why it's hurting you so much that's why something's hurting so much but the only worry that you have is that with the seven of pentacles in reverse that this was a disappointing situation long term investment that just didn't go right okay you didn't see this relationship coming into fruition that's your biggest issue here their issue has nothing to do with your issues right now if you ask me I think this person is feeling very lonely. Yes, they miss you with a star. Yes, they want rejuvenation. Yes, they want to heal. They want reconciliation. But again, four of wands in reverse, ten of wands in reverse. This is all home. 
conflict or responsibilities, none of which has to do with you. So if you are thinking that this person is not coming towards you and you are picking up on their energy, I don't think that's, again, they're leaving you out of the picture. It has nothing to do with you. What is their attitude towards you? Page of Swords in Reverse and the Four of Swords in Reverse. Right now they have nothing to say. This person has nothing to say right now at all to you. With a page of swords in reverse, this person is definitely keeping tabs on you, okay? Shitty communication, trying to come in, probably stalking you from fake accounts, whatever, right? But again, this person is very, very horrible at communication right now, okay? It could be someone very absent-minded, disorganized, okay? But yeah, this person doesn't really feel the depth right now, okay? I don't think you are their focus right now. Maybe when they get the time, they'll probably communicate with you or they'll just take long, long days before they communicate with you or they just flat out won't communicate. But they're keeping tabs on you, that's for sure. But again, you're dealing with someone, you know, who's very defensive also. You're, it's a very defensive partner, right? But uh, with the four of soldiers, this person feels the need uh, to, to not do anything about it right now. And that's what they're doing. They're not doing anything about it right now. Nor are you, nor are they. Again, because there's confusion, there's fear, and you're both just trying to see things from either, either you're both giving this time is what I'm getting. This, it's all about the waiting game. It's the waiting game. They feel the need to pull away, draw away, retreat right now, and they don't think this is the right time to communicate because they don't really have anything to say. Or it's more like, you know what, they're very defensive right now. They feel whatever they say, it's going to be, you know, probably you'll turn them around, things around towards them or you'll probably, you know, blame them for something or it's just, going to, it's just going to break into an argument. So they feel it's safer not to come and approach you. You, on the other hand, yeah, you want this. You want this. And how? Oh, well... All right, the likely outcome. We have the King of Cups in reverse and the Lovers in reverse. Why am I not surprised? All right, Taurus, you're dealing with, we have, you're the Page of Cups here. You're dealing with the King of Cups here. You're dealing with someone who's either very, very overwhelmed, at the same time, someone very anxious, very cold, could be very cold, but they're very withdrawn from you, okay? They have a lot of love for you, agreed. But this is someone who's repressing their feelings, okay? They're trying to manipulate you. This is a very manipulative energy, but not in a bad way. Manipulative as in, in a way that they love you, they want you, but they were not showing it to you, okay? Again, because their emotions are just not balanced right now. This person is having a very hard time trusting their intuition, okay? And because of that, with, with that, because of the, the lovers in reverse here, I think this is someone, because they're feeling, you're feeling the two of cups in reverse, they're feeling the lovers in reverse. This is the likely outcome. Could be both of you, but I'm getting more from this person. This person is having a really hard time making a right choice. They're very detached right now. Okay, communication can be a huge challenge between you guys. But again, there's disharmony and an imbalance. One person is probably very invested into this relationship than the other. Uh, or this is just someone who has fear of commitment. Okay, but right now they're holding back from you. That's why everything's on, on hold. Someone's got to give. Someone's got to make a move. Okay. But this person here, I feel, you know what? I feel this person needs some time to sort their own shit out. It's not you. I don't see anywhere where this person is probably even blaming you. For them, it's just like, you know what? I need to get my shit together and that's when I'm going to come towards you. Before that, they won't come towards you. So yeah, they're going to sort their own shit. They're going to solve their own problems and that's when they're going to come towards you. Okay, You, on the other hand, you, your attitude, yes, you feel this is the devil here again. Obsession, like I said, but the devil is also a very controlling feeling, okay? You're very attached to them also, which is in the wrong way. You're probably, in the three of swords, you're probably picking up on their energy. You're hurting even more because you feel they're not making a move towards you. But um, because, because I'm seeing what they're doing right now, right? Then no, their lack of action towards you is mm -hmm. only because they're already uh, occupied in something else, okay? Which has nothing to do with you. So that's what I have for you, Taurus. I hope this reading resonates with you. Leave your comments below, like, share, subscribe, and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.